everybody and welcome back to Jesus and Jammies. Jesus and Jammies is my favorite day of the week because we get to talk about Jesus but stay in our pajamas. Today we are going to talk about being brave. How many of you have ever felt scared or a little just intimidated or a little nervous about something? What about going to bed and everything is dark? Ooh, it doesn't feel very good, right? Or when you have to do something for the very first time and you don't know what to expect. Or when you have to go to the school for the first time and you don't know if you're going to have friends and you don't really want to go inside. Or how many of you, when you go to church, you don't know if you should go to kid's life because mommy and daddy are not going to be there. And it just feels a little weird sometimes. But... I want to tell you something. Jesus wants you to be brave. Have you ever felt afraid, Kelsey? Yeah. Yeah? When do you feel afraid? Well, one time when I was going to kids life, I and you guys who were starting to leave me, I was starting to cry because they missed you. Yeah, because sometimes when we miss somebody, we can get sad. But I want to tell you today a story of a guy in the Bible named David. He was just a little guy. He was, he was just a kid. And he went one day to take food for his brothers who were in a battle. And what did he find? A giant! No, not just a tall person. No, no, no. A giant. He was so huge. And everybody was so afraid of him. And he will come like a big bully and say, I am going to destroy you all. Bring me somebody that I can fight. And everybody was so scared. And nobody wanted to fight him. So everybody will hide and be like, oh no, he's here again. And he will do that every day three times a day. Can you imagine having a bully come to your house and say, I'm here to bully you again. Oh, I will probably run and hide too. But David came and he saw that and he was like, no, somebody needs to fight him. And everybody thought he was crazy because this giant was giant. He was huge. So he said, no, God is with me. And because God is with me, I can win. And guess what happened? He won. He went and he grabbed three stones. And he went like this. And like this. And like this. And look at the giant and threw the stone. And <gasps> the giant fell down. David had won. And he was just a tiny little guy. You and me can be brave because God is with us. You don't have to be afraid. You don't have to be nervous. You just know that God is with you and he wants you to be brave and he wants you to do good things. So today, make sure that you do that. When you feel a little nervous, when you feel afraid, maybe tonight when it's time for bed, just remember that even though the lights are off, and even though you might be doing something that you are not quite sure about, God is with you and he wants you to be brave and he wants you to do something good. See you next time.